The All-Star Open is where the bottom two-thirds in points, excluding champions, will fight it out for a spot in the Big Show and at the All-Star Race. On the pole for today's event is the 91 of Dylan Everminian. Two is outside is Evan Hunter. Third is Skylar Taylor. Fourth, Annie Thomas running at the top five. It is Josh Harmon. Stapleton, Crown Jr., Bigelow, Wells, and Henson round out the top ten. As the pace car goes in, getting set for 14 laps with these 19 drivers here at the 1.5 mile oval in Chicago. Here we go. Green flag is out. We're racing in Chicagoland. This race is the closest you can get to a shootout. You'll see these guys going for every spot they can early because they know that uh, this track can get wild. And rounding out the final corner, surprisingly, they keep it clean. Had to commentate the first lap just in case, but we're good. And Casey Wells down low, dives it down there. Has the whole inside lane check up. But clean and green still with a 21 or Roberto Crown Jr. in front. The 45 of Skylar Taylor gets the wall. You're going to see three drivers get in and around goes DeLello in the 73. To bring out your first caution of the day. I think these guys must have already taken the yellow. But the rest are racing back. The forward to the inside of the 78. See if he'll get there for that spot. He will not. 21 gets it. So yeah, like I was saying, it's the top, the top three that get in. But for now, let's take a look at uh, what happened here. Uh, it's, just, it's just a classic instance of four wide. Not going to work off of turn number four. That spins the lower around. Luckily, it was at the back of the field, so no one else really got involved. But that's a caution that uh, it's less laps that these drivers are going to be able to run. And this 14-lap uh, race, is, I think it was just a low and Jefferson shooting to the outside while the other guys checked up. And that got the 73 around. Fairly minor accident. Not really much to cover there. But you guys, back to the green flag here in a number of laps. I want to say it would be around lap 8. With the 21, the 78, the 4, the 45, the 91, the 17, the 97, the 94, the 98, the double zero. Your current top 10. Delo is not out. Um, he has really barely any damage, so, I mean, he'll probably be straight of the field, but there's the least of the field's problems. We have just seven to go at the line as the base car goes in. Halfway home here in the All-Star Open. Evan Hunter to the inside of Josh Harmon. He's going to try again on the 78 forward. Goes to the inside. The 78 scrapes the wall. Same with the 91. He'll be falling back. Now six laps to go. Hunter with the transfer. The last transfer spot. Now 78 looking to take his spot back. McShane working her way to the front of the field. Look at the dive bomb move from the double zero. Christian Vargas. And that's going to work out. He gets right to the back bumper of the 94. Who's going to go to the inside himself? 
Getting dicey for third here. They're going to go four wide for that spot. Now back to three wide, but still as intense as ever. As Vargas still on the inside lane, he drifts up the track. Look at the four, kind of get turned by the 97. Here we go, four wide once again for third. The 98, looks like she's going to clear for second. The 78 backed out. I think he might have hit the wall and all that turmoil, but now Vargas going for second here. The 94 trying to maybe split the middle. This is just to get into the all-star race. They're letting the 21 run away with it, but the battling back here is crazy. Look at this. The double zero blocking the four. And around they go back there. Maybe the 97 up from front of the 90, uh, the 78. <laughs> we stay green. There's no way this doesn't end in a crash. Yeah. The 77 in the wall. Spins it round once, keeps it going, but we are under caution. This will end the race, and this will be the transfer spot right here. The four up into the wall will be side by side between the 28 and the 94. And the 28 gets it. And it's a shame that ended the race, because that was, uh, I could have stayed green, to say the least. Watch this, four wide. And uh, there's really no getting out of it. The 77 and the 97 were kind of pushing up. And Oskin goes for a 360, but keeps on going at the expense of Owen Miles. But really no one else. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> okay, Jefferson got closer. I thought he would have definitely wrecked, but he didn't. So, yeah, fun racing in the All-Star Open. That gets Anton Chabois in. I... Uh, not, not quite sure where he came from, but he ends up getting third out of today. As the last transfer spot with Vargas uh, getting second and Roberto Crown Jr. getting first place. So missing out, the rest of the top 10 are Aiden Bigelow, Evan Hunter, Pre McShane, Josh Harmon, Andy Thomas, Casey Wells, and Nathan Stapleton all put on one good show. And uh, this is just a precursor. I feel like we say this a, a whole lot when it comes to the All-Star race. Cause, and that's because, really, it's it's just what we see in the All-Star Open. So you're going to see the 21 could take the checkered flag here. Might as well just show this. Roberto Crown Jr. officially your winner in the All-Star Open. But yeah, sometimes... These guys are just as hungry to to get in the race than to get that virtual million dollars. So, Crown Jr., Christian Vargas, and Anton Trabois are advancing. Christian Vargas just outside the top ten. He gained five spots last race and was knocking on the door as David Vickers fell back four spots. But ultimately, he did not make the cut originally, but now he's in. Anton Trabois, same with him. He is actually 12th in points. Uh, same cannot be said for Roberto Crown Jr. last in points. So I'm sure he's very happy to have a shot at this all-star race. So let's uh, let's get back to you guys later in the night. Uh, but first, victory lane with the 21. Thank you for watching the Android Cup Series. We'll see you next time.